Good morning, everyone. If you can't tell, I just woke up. Look at my hair. It was in a bun and I just brushed it out. No, it's like crazy. But I just washed my face and I thought I would start the vlog early so I can show you guys what I do for my skincare in the morning. So this is the face soap that I use morning and night. And then I will use Cetaphil face lotion. And then I like to use this mermaid skin. And then just this everyday serum with vitamins in it so that's what I do in the morning and then at night I will sometimes use this like two to three times a week with retinol in it very good for like aging and then I also use this at night these are all linked in my Amazon store they're going crazy I'm sorry it's so loud I also had a few uh, breakfast groceries ordered this morning so what I got were these caramel rice cakes some bananas some English muffins. These are so good with just butter or peanut butter on them. Some eggs, strawberries, these double shot energy vanilla Starbucks drinks. I've never had these, I don't think, or maybe I have. I don't really remember if I liked them or not, but sometimes I need the double shot. And then I just got this regular iced coffee that I really like. This, I didn't know it was this big when I ordered it, but this massive tub of natural peanut butter <laughs> it's so big. And some Duke's Mayo, which, yay, this one was successful because last time I ordered it, it came looking like this. Like straight yellow oil. It looks so gross. Like melted popcorn butter. That's what it looks like. So I'll finally be throwing this away. I don't know why I kept it in my fridge. I thought maybe it would like re- Harden. I don't know what happened. It's gross. It doesn't expire until like three months too, so I don't know what the deal is. This rain is making my hair crazy. I just got back from getting my nails done. Yay. They look so good. Here is the finished product. It's just a gray color. The shade was 133 in dip powder. I don't know if it's different at every salon. But yeah, yeah, I'm really happy with them. Leave a comment down below how much your guys' dip nails cost. I'm just curious because I feel like they're expensive. Um, these are like 58 and then I had to get two nails fixed. So the total is like 77 plus I, I tipped $20. This so was like 98 or 97 whatever. I know dip is more pricey, but let me know. But yeah, I did have two repairs and I don't know. Let me know if you guys think I should go somewhere different. I love this place though, but it is pricey. So every time I go to get my nails done, PetSmart is right next door. So I always get my babies something. I got the matching collars. Look how stinking cute. So I did not know the how big Hershey's neck was. So I got her a size small. I don't, oh, maybe it will fit. Maybe it will fit. And then an extra small for Moji. Look how cute, there's little hearts on them. And then I also got them both these bones. They love bones. And I always just get one, and then they want the same exact one, even though there's so many other bones in this house. But got them each the same one. You want the new bone? Will you spin? Spin? Okay, handstand. <laughs> Take it. Mochi, I have one for you. You want one too? Handstand. Handstand. <laughs> Hershey already got one. Mochi, right here. Look. See, they still want the same exact one when there's two of them. They just want the one that the other one has. <laughs> Hershey wants them both. <laughs> Look at the new matching colors. Oh, so beautiful. You guys are so beautiful. Those are so cute, and they fit perfect. Yay! Yay, 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 so excited. <laughs> okay, let's do a little unboxing haul from what I got at the mall today, me and my mom. Went out to lunch, and then we went to the mall. So, from Bath & Body Works, I needed some travel size stuff for when I go traveling, especially when I go to LA next week. So it was buy three, get one free. So I got three of this scent for body wash. This smells, smells very, very good. So perfect for traveling, and that's my favorite body wash. It's so soapy, and it gets lathered up really nicely. Easy for shaving your legs and all that. And then I got, for my freebie, the lotion. 
And then I also just got these two lotions. This is Snowflakes and Cashmere. This was on sale because it was from like the Christmas collection. So this was like 75% off. And it smells very, very good. Then I went to Victoria's Secret. I wanted to get some fresh underwear. Get some fresh, good underwear that also fits me better. Um, so I got two gray sizes. One black pair. This pink pair. I like lace thongs. These are like the comfiest ones. This pink and white polka dot pair. They're like all sell, sold out of the Valentine's Day ones. Just this cheetah g-string great for leggings and then just a white thong so i got five for 35 i believe and then my mom gave me a coupon for a free panty and then i got just a little roll-on perfume in heavenly this smells so good and then check out how cute this candle is it's a tease candle which this scent from victoria's secret is so good smells just like it next i got some new sunglasses for the year I love them. Is this not just like a look? Like I love them. Just a look. A vibe. I feel like a detective. Next up from this store called Blended. I got this adorable candle that I'm going to put at my coffee bar. It smells so good too. So... It says coffee bar on it, and it has a huge coffee bean. I saw my mall put an FYE store in my mall. We never had one, and I haven't been in the mall in a long, long time. Super excited. Super excited to have a four-year entertainment store because it has so many cute things. So getting started. I got this big plush for my gaming room. Can you guys hear the rain? It's a big hamster. Look at the chubby cheeks. I am obsessed in its little hands. It's so cute. So I got that. <laughs> and I got one more plushie. I know. I know. Me and my plushies. This one matches perfectly with my gaming room, though. The pink. And it's a donut cat. It's so cute. And then I got this limited edition Japan crate. It is filled with a bunch of limited edition stuff. I don't know if it's candy. I don't know if it's knickknacks. I really have no idea. But this was $50. I'm going to make a video on this. Seems like there's a lot of stuff in here. So this will be exciting. And then last but not least, I got two little Minecraft figures. <laughs> I honestly don't know. Let's see what this looks like. I think it's just a little small figurine. This store's expensive. This is so small. I love Minecraft though. Anytime I see something Minecraft, I have to get it. Oh my gosh, it's so cute. Oh, look at it. Look. And its little legs spin. So I can look around. That is so cute. I'm going to put it in front of my computer. And then I also got a little piggy. And then they also had like a creeper and a pumpkin, like some other ones, but I wanted these two. Let's see what the pig looks like. Oh, look at the little piggy. Oh, it's head bubbles. Look how cute. Little pig. <laughs> so it's now, oh my gosh, it's 11.40 already. <gasps> Wow. Well, I'm having a night and I just got off my gaming computer and I was playing Minecraft. I got some new like resource packs. They have changed the game so much. I was playing like a SpongeBob version. It was sweet. But first day playing on it, the Wi-Fi was kind of bad. So streaming might be a little, a little difficult. I also just Grubhubbed a burger. I know it's, I didn't realize it was so late. It was taking a while to get here as well. But, yeah, I, uh, I grub-hubbed a burger and some potato, or no, I got onion rings, not potato teasers, just onion rings. I was gonna get a milkshake too, but I'm like, that is just too much. All I had today though was Cane's. I got the three finger combo, which they're chicken fingers. I swear, they're making them bigger again because 
They were huge and they used to be like that big. There was a time when they were super small, but they're big again. I could only eat two, well, two and a half, but then I got so full that I couldn't even finish my fries. And then that's all I had all day, along with a lot of goldfish, because I brought goldfish up to my, my PC when I was playing Minecraft, so I was hungry, so I just kept eating more and more goldfish. I, I literally have stuff. Oh, it's getting dropped off right now as I talk about it. I like to wait until the, the guy drives away. It's literally almost midnight and I'm eating a burger, but it's Friday and I'm gonna be up late anyways, hanging out, so. Ooh, these look so good, look at these onion rings. <gasps> Maybe I'll make a TikTok eating it. I could do that. Woohoo, honey mustard. They gave me two, jackpot. And then I just get a cheeseburger with Mustard, ketchup, onions, mayo, lettuce, and tomato on it. You have to add everything individually. I'm like, give me all the toppings. I don't care if it's a dollar extra for a tomato. Ridiculous. But it's good. Oh yeah, see they load on those onions. <laughs> I made a little TikTok eat with me. I always like to do like minute long little videos on TikTok like that. Just a variety of content. You guys know, and I got mustard splashed all over me in the TikTok. And you guys know, my wash machine is broken. So I'm just like ruining all my clothes and I just got this. But look, I already ate like half of it so quickly. I know yesterday, I put on brand new jeans. And I was like, these are so cute. And they're from Abercrombie. You guys saw the jeans. I shared them um, with you guys in our last vlog. Maybe that was a couple days ago. Anyways, I got a stain on them, Alfredo sauce, in my Olive Garden mukbang. And I came home and I, my mom got me a Tide stick for Christmas, which I needed that. I like Tide sticked it a few times and the stain would not come out. Like, I think I finally got it out after like scrubbing it with water. But I'm like, I really need a wash machine because I am kind of a messy eater. I like am, but I'm not. Because I know you guys said before in the comments that like, like, how'd you not get anything on your white shirt? Like, I'm eating, like, Taco Bell or something. It's always, like, the most random times. Like, when I'm eating something so simple. Like, opening up a honey mustard. That'll definitely stay in. I need to put the Tide stick on it. Well, guys, I hope you all enjoyed this vlog. And I will see you all in the next one. Bye, guys.